welcome back to my channel. Me. <laughs> what? <laughs> this is my loving boyfriend. Mm. Tell them who you are. So hello everyone, my name is Gonzalo. And I am her loving boyfriend. <laughs> and as you can see, we are doing something today with my face. No, your hair. Oh yeah, my hair <laughs> and, well, you guys will see in the video. So this hair has been how long of a process? A y two years, almost two years. Of growing this long, luscious hair. Yeah, and if you guys can't see it well, it is literally down to my chin at this point. Yeah, pretty which, much. Which I've got to say, for two years worth of uh, growing hair out, it's not really that long. Yeah. I expected it to be at least down here, which is how I want it. I want it up to my shoulders. Yeah, but it's still pretty long. So... In this video today, I'm going to be showing you guys some products that he uses pretty regularly-ish. Yeah. Ish. Mostly, mostly when I gotta like look preppy or you know. Yeah. When you're going out, things like that. But like if it's just us two to the movies, I normally just tie this back, which we'll get to at a you know later in this video. But yeah. All right. But for now, if you guys want to see what I do to his hair, then just so for the watching. first hairstyle that I'm going to show you guys, it doesn't require any product, really just a brush. And if your significant other does not know how to do this, you can either do it for him or just teach him how to do it. Really, you're just going to bring all the hair back Keep one hand back on your head. Well, not on your head, on their head. And I just like to brush the hair up into my hand and grab when doing a ponytail. You want to make sure all pieces are up. Now, in any instance, you do not need product for this. But if you have frizzier hair or just thinner hair that falls out easily, you can use product. And I'll show you those products in one second. So once you have all the hair pulled back and everything is seamless from front to back, you're gonna take your hair tie, pull it over your hand around the hair. You're gonna make a twist, pull it over the hair, twist again, Pull it over the hair and just repeat the process until uh, the hair tie is laid tight and I like to pull the hairs a little bit just because I don't like it slick slick back I like there to be a little bit of roots showing just to keep it like daytime appropriate it's not really slick back but it's pretty back and out of his way and you can see his hairline if you could do a little turn. Now face front for me. Perfect. All hair is pulled back. If you wanted to use some product, if you had any flyaways, easily you could take this hairspray. Try to get this to show. There it is. This is the big sexy hairspray. This is actually pretty expensive. This is about $20 at the drugstore. But this hold is actually really, really good on any type of hair. My hair is really thin and it works great. And his is actually really, really thick and holds a lot of moisture. And it still works really well. If you were to use it, just uncap it, shake it a little bit. And then make sure you cover the face. And then just spray and slick back with that same hand. And then repeat the process until you get your desired hold then if you don't want to do a ponytail you can do the exact same thing that I just said you can just spray with hairspray but in his case his hair is extremely thick so he uses this some hair cream this is from the grooming lounge online. How much did you buy this for? Probably like 15 bucks, if that. 15 <clears throat> bucks for five ounces? That's actually not that bad. No, normally they give it on sale, so you could probably, if you search at the right time, you could probably get it for 10 bucks, if that. And it smells really good. It has somewhat of a male cologne scent. 
Yeah. It's not really, it's it's good for when you have shorter hair and when you're just trying to style it. But if you're looking for a hold, I'd recommend some of our later products that she's going to be presenting to yeah, you. Yeah, this one is more lightweight. In the directions it says, this is a lightweight cream committed to keeping hair neat and tidy. Moisturizes, protects, and conditions while fighting the good fight against frizz. Stiffness and greasiness not included. Developed in our DC Barbershop. So if you want your hair to look like this slick back and it's still nicely formed you can have that however if you want to run your hands through it you still can it's still going to be nice and soft you're still going to be able to move it around a little bit it's just going to mainly keep the frizz down and keep the hair in control with this product you probably only want to use about the size of a quarter and then just build don't ever start off with more product than you need you want to start off small and go large now if you're trying to keep this style back and keep it back and you want to keep it back back from the rain the wind the snow the sleet and the hail then you want to use a thicker product and this is a putty correct yes it is and where did you get this same thing the grooming lounge online and how much did you pay for it probably another 15. same price yes and this one has a weirder scent what does it smell like i don't know i actually can't lemon it has like a lemony smell to it like a clean scent it should say in the front it does not. No. Has more of a clean scent. Um, but yeah. No, this is. Go ahead. Normally, sometimes this would retail around like 15 to 25, depending when you purchase it, because I purchased it when there was a sale, everything that she just showed. So you can most likely get it a lot cheaper if you know when to shop for it, which is normally when holidays are out Thanksgiving, Christmas, Halloween. Mm hmm. But um, to keep in mind, this is this is a putty. So right now, if I were to use it, it would work, but it wouldn't really suffice because I'd have to use a lot and a lot repeatedly. If I want something to hold my hair back now, I'd have to use more of a gel consistency, something that stiffens it and keeps it hard. So this is more for your like your medium hair, not longer hair. Like if you guys couldn't tell, this is pretty, pretty, pretty long because it and reaches thick. Yes. So something like a putty wouldn't suffice for me anymore. I'd have to use. If I do use the putty, I'd have to use the putty and the Big Sexy Hairspray to keep it off from moving. Right. And how much of this would you use? Probably what you mentioned, a quarter, if not a little more. I would build up to it because if you use too much, then your hair is going to get white and it might become a... Uh, flaky. Flaky. There we go. So it it's going to look flaky. like you have some dandruff. Yes, which you do not. You want to avoid 100% of the time. So if you use a quarter of this and you have thicker hair and you don't want to go the gel route... Like he said, you can use a quarter of this and build up to the intensity that you want in your hair. And then you can take the Big Sexy Hairspray and don't forget to cover the face and just spray all over the head and mix in with that product as well to keep it back. Are you satisfied with all your products? I am indeed. <laughs> <laughs> this is his new haircut. Well, I've been building up to this haircut. It's been a two-year process. I've always wanted to create a man bun, which that's why she's emphasizing now. Yes. Because I'm able to actually have a somewhat man bun. Yes. What I showed you earlier, if you could turn to the side again, peek, please. Oh, turn Yeah, your whole body. I'll show you how to do a man bun. It's actually the exact same thing. You're just going to brush the hair back into your hand. You're going to take your hair tie. You're going to put it in the hair. Of course, this works only if the hair is long enough. You're going to do the twists as if you were doing a regular ponytail. On the last twist that you do, take the hair tie and just fold it underneath the hair. Pull it slightly and you have your own little man bun. I think man buns look cuter when they are shorter. I'd like them to be a little bit perky on the outside. You want yours longer, don't you? Yeah, I kind of want my, <laughs> my man bun to be like really big. Like currently right now, it's not too big. It's like the palm of my fist. Yeah. But I kind of want it to be at least two or three. Yeah. Which you kind of don't want, but I'm going <laughs> to grow I, it out. Hey, I don't like it either way. It's you. I love you either way. Maybe. But I like the little one too. I think it's pretty cute. I think it's great. Yeah. Yeah, I can't really complain about it. Yeah. 
This hairstyle is pretty good for keeping long hair, but also having short hair, if that makes sense. Keeping it professional. If you want to keep it professional, but also want to... Have long hair, you're good. Yeah, because you could always style this to your kneading as well. It doesn't have to be an opponent, so we're just using it as an example. Yeah. But um, maybe in the future video, we'll actually style it to show you guys what that actually looks like. Yeah. But when it's longer, yeah. we'll see. Well, it's still able to be styled how I yeah. used to, like before I used to have a faux hawk. Yeah. And um, I could probably do it now, but it's going to take a lot more product. New product, because the putty, unfortunately. Is not going to work as well. Yes, so I would have to upgrade to a gel or something of a more firmer consistency. Yeah. But I like it either way, in the pony or in the man bun. I think they're both great. Me too. So that is it, guys, for this video. I wanted to mention to you guys that he does have his own YouTube channel. He does gaming online and posts like 800 times a day every single day what? a lot more than me what? <laughs> <laughs> so he is the scientific gamer i always have him linked in my description if you guys want to check him out or if you guys have any significant others who love gaming as well and want to check that out definitely go subscribe to his channel because it's great and he's very talented and knowledgeable on everything that he talks about and does on his channel and if you want to see us play please check out our crash bandicoot series that yes, did on my channel that was so much fun yes i'm a little <laughs> upset that it's over with i know it was crash fun. was a great game yes it was indeed but that is it you guys if you have any questions on the hair products that i mentioned just drop a comment down below and we'll both be able to answer them for you if you want to see more videos with my handsome, also give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave and turn on notifications to be notified for when I post. I post on Monday through Friday. I don't think I have anything else to say except I'll see you guys in my next video. See you guys later. Bye. Peace.